Wow. Few months to the new year, and yes, I am doing my first Transformer review of 2017. What I'm doing? None other than Transformers Generation Voyager Class Springer. Yes, guys, I'm back for a whole new beginning. Stick around, because I'm about to pop them open and see what I'm working with. Because I'm going to enjoy checking out Springer. Finally, we got his first op mode, which is the armored car. Now, unlike the original cartoon version and the original G1 cartoon, this still has some good parts to it that I can respect and like. Based off the original one and the cartoon design, it is still kind of like a lot more better than the original. I like the design, the aesthetics, and you can use your um, blaster as a working turret. Now it does fire pretty far. You don't want to lose your missiles. You'd be like, oh man, where did I can find them at? Still, I kind of dig it because it's more modern to the days, um, to, um, modern figures, and still, I like it. Now, do I like it while it rolls? Oh yeah, it got some good rolling power. Yet, transform can be tedious, but also a pain to do. And try and get it more condensed and more not losing its parts. But everybody asks me, how in the world are we going to do the um, second art mode? Well, we're going to find out in just a moment and see how I'm going to work with as soon as I can get them transformed. So, hang tight, guys. It'll be another moment. Whoa! Be you got a flight stand for your Cotter mode? Oh, yes indeed. Borrowed it from Jay DeRoe. But yet, yeah, I use this as a perfect setup for the stage and fit well to a Springer. Yet, unlike the original action figure, this here is a little bit more better than, than the original G1 toy. Yet, modern times always work in some mysterious ways. Still, I kind of dig the Akata mode. I like how you use them and got them posing the stand. And I mean, wow. And I like how I got it. Still, it's just that fitting so well and made it so popular and so dope, which is the, to my liking. I mean, fit it so well, you have no complaints, but still, can it fit good as a robot? Only time will tell after I transform him and see how I'm working with and what I like about it. All you can say is, wow, it's worth the wait, and plus get a little bit more closer to, I'm just digging how it looks from afar. And up close, it looks pretty freaking good. Now let's get into robot mode. Oh my god. Now that is a Springer figure that I've been waiting for years. Much many years. Unlike the third party who trying to do a Springer that fit the mold, still, I like the Hasbro version way better. From the size to the height, even the striking pose just <clears throat> I mean <clears throat> I love it. Now we got I neglect to put the um his gun in the back because I don't want to ruin this pose with it because with the sword he's ready to go all out Highlander. And I mean he's ready to chop any set of confos down with one strike and quickness. I mean wow. Now overall I like the articulation on him and you tell him when you got him in a striking pose, you know something good comes down. I wish I had a third party with his regular gun and added Gatlin gun. It will make it just too sweet. And I mean too freaking sweet. Now overall I like the articulation, the art molds, even every bit of his accessories. This is a strongly recommended grade worth picking up. Still it's just that Springer is one of my favorites out of this line. I mean this is worth the wait. And finally, I found him at a good price. And when I got him, oh yes, this is the Springer that gotta be in your collection. So again, it is strongly recommended. It's worth picking up, guys. Find me your local online stores or eBay stores and get them while it's hot. This has been the first of many reviews coming soon on S1939. All you gotta do is subscribe and follow me on social media accounts and. Always give your thumbs up and keep keep the reviews going, guys. Until the next video, I catch y'all later. Peace.
Thanks for watching the video, guys. Please comment, smash that thumbs up, hit that notification bell, and share the video. But the most important part, subscribe. More videos are underway. Also, if you're on social media like from from this here platform, follow me there. I post the new stuff sometime every day or some of the days, but I guarantee you much more views yet to come. All I gotta say is one more thing before heading out of here. Thank y'all for watching the video. But if you're thirsty for more, always hit the subscribe button right there with the button right there. And also, if you haven't seen the last video, hit the last video pick right there. Until the next video, guys, I catch y'all later. Peace.